Hey guys, it's your boy Case here, back in with another video. Today we're doing some more. Well, what are we doing today? What are we doing today? What are we doing today? Today we'll be doing some more Green Monkey Vamp talk videos for you guys. That's right, we're doing some more. Continue with our continue with part two. Let's continue with the houses that will be available. We'll be showing off the houses. Um, there's eight different houses, house types in the game revamp. There will be. Um, how do I notice? It says one. It says two out of eight. So let's go look at the next one. So we'll look at the third one out of the eight. This is one of the other houses. We have a two car garage. So let's zoom in a little bit. I like this house. Out of all the ones they have shown so far, this is my favorite one. Um, it's a two-car garage. This is really for like you're living with a friend. This is great for them. Um, it's just a really nice house. I really like it, guys. There's not much to say about it. It's just I really like the house. It's just something about it. I just really love it. We're gonna go down to one more. This is the the second my second favorite. This is the la the uh, fourth one, I think. This is four out of eight. So this is the other house you available to you. Um. Obviously, when I go when I play the for the first time, I'll get a house like this. If the other ones aren't better, um, I'll probably get a house like this. Park my car in the main one here or something like that. You know, that's what I probably do. You know, I like this house, guys. I like it a lot. So that was that that house. So here's the area here. So this is the subway. If you guys cannot see what see what's going on well, this is the subway right here. So this is the subway. This is the revamp subway. Um, I like it. It's basically what we have now, just touched up. Because you know, just uh, you know, basically I said it's touched up, it looks different. Out the color of the brick on the outside is the same. Um, it looks different. Obviously, the parking lot is looks better. It just looks better, but it, it's more, um, you know. Here's the inside of Revamp Subway again. It's a revamp, better looking version, better version of what we have now. But it's not like a completely different building, you know. Like you can tell, it a lot of it is very similar, almost you know, same as what we got now. You know that chip spiral thing that we have even now in a subway is there. So it's looks. I'm not. I'm proud of it. I think they're doing a great job. But that is not all, my friends. That is not all. Do you know why? We're gonna go to Trello. Why are we going to Trello? Why? Look at cars. Duh. What, what, come on, guys. Look at cars. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna talk about the cars. What I think about them. So we're gonna. And again, this is just purely going over stuff so you guys know what's going on and you guys aren't out the loop. So here's one vehicle here. We're going to hit watch when it's the share. Let's, can we share this? Uh, can, we, can we share? No, I don't want to print this. No. We're not going to print that. We're not printing it. All right. So let's just case it. So... This is the Eldorado, the 1959 Eldorado. Now, 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 what do I think of this car personally in the game so far? I see this not in the game, but what do I think of it? Um, I think it's going to drive pretty bad. Um, and this is not because I have anything against the car itself. This is just based on cars we have now in Greenville, uh, classic cars, which I will make a whole video just talking about this. Um, the called the problem, a uh, 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 called the problem. I'm um, called the problem with. I said the problem with. I'm sorry, the, yeah, the problem with um, classic cars in Greenville. I'll make a whole list of problems that purely must car. And if you guys want me to make it to a series where I explore all the problems with each category of vehicle in Greenville, hey, I will do that. I'm definitely gonna do the muscle car one. All right, so that video, expect that video because I expect that video to come out either tomorrow, if um if I can't do it tomorrow for some odd reason, um it's gonna be it's gonna be posted Friday or next Saturday, so um yeah let's let's continue let's continue. Here's the front. 
I like the way this car looks a lot. Trust me. I'm a big freaking fan. Whoa. Hold the phone. Too fast. <coughs> and again. <coughs> oh, again. Zoom out just a tiny bit. Um, again, I like this car too. I love the Mustang, guys. But again, I will make a video on that issue that these muscle cars in Greenville tend to have. Um, again, this problem could be fixed in Greenville in the revamp version when it comes out. But for now, they, they all have this issue. All right, so looks. I like the rims. I like the way this car looks. I love it. So we're going to give it a watch on that. It's a classic. Now, um, I will be making multiple videos on if we're going to replace it. It's cause I'm going to make multiple videos on this stuff. Keep you guys updated with as much as possible. You guys will know. All right. It, it's just this, this whole series of the revamp talk video series I do on my channel is purely for one reason and one reason only. Now it's to keep you guys up to date on the revamp information so you are not in the dark. That is why I do these videos. And when for that, I will not be doing these videos, trust me. So I'm doing it for y'all. For y'all. Alright, here's Okay. The Beetle. I don't, think I don't think this car would be that great. Um, like, I don't know. I'm not a fan of the Beetle. Um, you guys may be, but that's the Beetle vehicle. We're not voting for that thing. It has 14 votes, sadly. Um, here are the vehicles I think would do great. So here it is the, the 1967 Chevy Camaro. Now, let's talk about this thing, guys. Let's get into this. Deep into this. Let's, get, let's get into this, guys. Let's get into this. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna guy for real, real though. Um, we don't know. The car looks great. It, it really does look great. I like the way the tail lights are. I like. The, I just. It looks so good. Um, I just don't know if it's gonna be as hype as they say it is. Cause again, now, honestly, in well, my opinion, when it comes to classic cars in Greenville, you kind of have to lower your expectations. Um, not because. They don't, the, the developers aren't good at making muscle cars. It's because they're muscle cars. They're classic muscle cars. And again, they can't make, when they when developers make this game, they cannot make the classic muscle cars as fast, like crazy, you know. Because again, they wanted to, they, now yes, there are classic model car, classic cars with modern engines and stuff in it. But that's not what the point is. Class, these are supposed to be classic cars, classic engine in it. So you can't say too much. But you do have to lower your expectations. Reason for this is because the handling. When it comes to the sound, how the muscle cars sound, you need to raise your expectations quite a bit because the must they nail the muscle car sound every time. The um, acceleration, handling, acceleration, not the best, but we we kind of like we kind of um, excuse that because from that at that time period. That was fast, but when it comes to handling and braking, you do have to lower your expectations when it comes to muscle cars. I know that sounds like, Nate, really? But you really have to do it, and especially with a car like this. I will be reviewing as many vehicles as I can at Greenville. Trust me, I got you. So let's just look at this. So we'll look at at least two more cars in this, at least a, one, I say, oh, we'll look at one more car for this video. The 1971 Dodge Challenger RT. This is I'm looking forward to. It looks great. Um, this thing, this about, but that's based off of looks. This thing could be a fast freaking muscle car. I mean, fast. Um, handling wise, I get a I feel I get that vibe that this is gonna have a better handling than the other ones, but it's not gonna be that good. But again, when it comes to handling for classic muscle cars in this game, you have to, and I mean, you have to lower your expectations so you don't. You know, be like, oh, what the hell? This handling's not that great. Why? Oh, that sucks. You know, because I had friends who played this game, got the most cars, said, oh, this handling sucks on this thing. Well, you should have lowered your expectations because you expected too much. So, that's all. That's pretty much it. So, I think I'm going to end the video here. Make sure you guys subscribe for more content like this. If you guys want more Greenville Remap Talks and other stuff more to keep you guys up to date, please let me know in the comment section. Drop a like, comment, and share. And I'll see you amazing people in my next video I do put out for you guys. Peace.
Oh, 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 oh,